I am doing this, I'm gonna be making my own rerun headcanon. I know this isn't gonna be great, but hey, there's nothing stopping me, so here we go. So, it is the year 2008, or 2007, I'm not really sure. I guess it's just 2008, same year that Sonic Unleashed came out, but anyways. There is this animator named Lilith, and life is going pretty well for them. They have a family and all that, and you know, things are going great. But oh no, her uh, family was like at a movie, and then eventually didn't drive correctly, and then this happened. Then after all of that, we get this pretty terrifying police report, I'm mentally scarred for life, and I guess she just picks up her family's belongings or just goes to the crime scene, and it's just, uh, very sad and stuff. And then she becomes very sad and depressed, and she just is unable to really do her work correctly, but then it starts becoming harder on her. Her budget gets cut, and her bosses are just like, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna overwork you, because we're, uh, we're evil and stuff. Or we need money. And so as Lilith is on frame 165, this happens. Oh no, me heart stopped! <laughs> I'm fucking dying! Eventually all of her bosses find out that she's just literally dead, so they're just like, Oh, let's put her in a closet or something, you know, and we're gonna go like drink some Miller Lite because we're rich. So then her show just airs normally on TV. She's not even credited, just, they just like scratched her out of the show, she's gone, and I think there's like no season two, it just gets cancelled or something. Well, actually, it's pretty popular and stuff, and I guess it does get a season two, but, uh, Lilith is not happy about this and then comes back as some, like, a literal eldritch horror monster. I also gotta fit this into the canon somehow. Uh, I guess she got married or something, so... I, I don't know. Anyways, she's mad and she wants to get her revenge, so every night at 12 p.m., I think, I probably got it wrong, She's gonna get her revenge. So she goes around to all the different bosses' house, just killing them one by one, and especially a certain important one. They die too, and, uh, I guess the police get involved because weird stuff is going on in the Warner building, but there's, like, no evidence for some reason, so... Oh well, there's not much they could do about that. And then that eventual person who, like, tried calling the police dies too, so... Lilith becomes all-powerful and becomes the queen of the cartoon realm. So, you know, she's super powerful now, and it's just like, basically, like, her bosses have no chance of standing up to her. And they really do try, for several years on end, they're stuck in that cartoon that she made. And every day, Stretchy Spaghetti Sonic and her boss Mecha Sonic get into extreme, like, arguments, like, debating all the time. Basically like this. Everyone has Uno, dipshit. It came free with your fucking Xbox. I didn't get it, I have the oldest Xbox known to man. No, you don't. I bought mine on day one, you fucking tard. Well, mine didn't have it. You have Uno! So, you know, several years goes by. Lilith just jumps around to different cartoons, I guess possessing, like, Spongebob Squarepants, Mordecai and Rigby, and, uh, Luigi. So eventually the bosses in, like, Mecha Sonic decide, what if we use the seven Chaos nachos? That doesn't work and they instantly die on the spot. Well, not really, because they're already dead. Oh, I gotta fit this in here, so Lilith finds out about Spinel, and as she is playing Baldi's Basics, she just murders her. She's all like, hey, we're not so different, and then just murders her on the spot. Guys, it's Spinel. Oh no, me heart stopped! <laughs> and then eventually she becomes this horrific monster thing. So all the bosses are fed up with this crap, and they gotta do something. So we basically get the Kirby Star allies of the rerun series, and like they're like, oh, wait, there's like this big apology or something. And then Lilith dies or something, or we get this pretty epic climactic fight or something. And, uh, I don't know, she sees her family again or something. Nah, just kidding, they all die in the end, the end. And that is my rerun headcanon. It's pretty bad, but at least I tried, so... Hey, I hope you enjoyed my crappy fanfiction. Stay tuned next time when I try to figure out the Wii Sports headcanon, if there even is one, or timeline. Bye, guys.